Hello everyone, welcome back to Urban Bites and today I'm going to share with you all a delicious fish curry recipe. Fish curry is something most of us enjoy eating but today's curry is made out of coconut milk. So let's check out how to do the fish curry using coconut milk. Before we jump into the video, if you are not subscribed then please do subscribe to my channel and also share your thoughts in the comment sections below as it really motivates me to do more videos. So let's check out the recipe. I'm using my clay pot here rather than the usual pot, the clay pot will give you an additional taste. Once the pot is heated, I'm adding 3 tablespoons of coconut oil. Then goes 1 teaspoon of fenugreek seeds. Then goes 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. Sort it until the raw smell goes. And then next goes one medium sized onion, finely chopped. Mix everything well in the oil. Adding one medium sized tomato. Adding 3 green chilies and handful of curry leaves. Let the onions and tomatoes get mixed and cooked very well. Now let's add some masalas into it. Adding 1 teaspoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder. 2 teaspoon of regular chili powder and you can reduce the level of the chili powder if you don't want it to be more spicy. Adding half a teaspoon of turmeric powder. Start mixing them. Once they turn into a nice reddish color, add coriander powder, about 2 teaspoons. Add half a teaspoon of fenugreek powder. Once the raw smell goes, let's add 2 cups of water. Add the required salt. Next time adding few pieces of Cambodia. This is also called as Goraka in Sri Lanka and in India it is called as Malabar Tamarind. When you see little bubbles coming out you can start adding the fish. So I have taken here 400 grams of tuna fish. And I've added the fish here already. So just giving it a small mix and letting it to get cooked. You can cook it for about 10 to 15 minutes. As it is fish, it gets cooked very quickly. So let's open the lid after 10 minutes. The fish has already cooked well and I'm adding half a cup of thick coconut milk. Give it a quick mix and let it get cooked for about 5 to 10 minutes. And that's it, we are done with our delicious fish curry. It turned out to a very colorful and a tempting dish. Fish curry with coconut milk is now ready to be served. 
this curry is a very tasty one and also it's a very mild curry as we didn't use lots of turmeric or tomatoes also a different recipe rather than the usual fish curries so enjoy with your family and let me know the feedback in the comment section below thank you so much for watching see you again with another new video